takes the brown parts off. <laughs> Who allowed the brown part to come? <laughs> <What>? <laughs> I think everybody knows what we're doing. You have been asking for us to take you guys shopping. Today we are showing you what our family normally buys. Yay! Food shopping! Like my mom's videos, make sure to subscribe and like. Up we go to where all the food is. We have two trolleys with us just to make sure that everything fits. Obviously, we might not get everything that we normally get. We might forget a few things, but at least you're gonna get an idea of what we normally buy. Get the bird inside the trolley. <laughs> yeah, so we don't buy these. Many people know that we live in Finland, so some of the items will look the same, but the name will be different at the front. So I will just say what it is in English or the children. <laughs> go again, go again. And this is where we get our coconut oil. <laughs> Whee! Yeah, that's probably <laughs> the people are laughing at you. Okay, welcome to food shopping with us. First thing on the list, Romeo, do you want to grab the coconut oil? We actually put Romeo inside there and this is how we do food shopping. Bye. Oh, no, 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 stop. <laughs> Don't, you're going to get us kicked out. Mum and children get kicked out of shopping centre. Couscous. Yep. Lasagna strips. Pasta is vegan in most cases. If you look at the back and it says it may contain egg or milk, it doesn't actually mean that it does contain. It means that something else has gone through the machine that may have had egg or milk in it, but that still makes it vegan. But obviously, if you have allergies, you don't go for those products. But most pasta is vegan. Two spaghettis. This is considered a junk food at our house. We usually have it on a Saturday night. And we have beans for protein in it anyway. We usually buy a lot of pasta. We usually have potatoes and vegetables and other things to fill our food. Not really the pasta area. Pasta area is junk food, just like yeah, Cliff. I just said. what we normally get, but we get a bigger version of it. How many is in the other bag? Is it about 10 kilos? 10, 10 kilos. Yeah. But yeah, we're not going to go to that shop right so now. This is porridge rice. But well, we like using it for sushi because it like sticks together and goes really nice and soft. I'm going to put this rice in here. Do we want you to see what we do buy in rice? Also some brown rice. Apart from the 10 kilo bag of jasmine rice, we also like buying basmati rice. Two bags of that one. Yes, our family does go through a lot more rice than just these two. But we go shopping often. Not once a month like some people. Jerusalem carries his drumsticks everywhere. Where's the other one? There. there. We don't buy mashed potato, we make it ourselves at home with our own potatoes. That's right, our own Tastes mashed better. potato. It does! Now having 10 children, you would think that we get a lot of cereal. Here's a cereal aisle. We never get cereal. Never. We never. No one even thinks to go get it. Yeah. Never ever. That's right. We never buy cereal for our children. Never in the morning, never in the afternoon. Cereal has never been a part of our life for the last 20 years. No cereal for our children, but we make our own muesli. Yes, yes, that's really nice. So we buy lots of oats, nuts. Sultanas. Exactly. We will go and buy those things instead, and we will go to a big bag of oats. These are the oats we buy to make muesli, porridge, and my favorite is to just pour milk into it. And have it. King James actually just likes to eat it. Like when we make porridge, he eats it without sugar or berries or anything. He just eats it and he just like. All the meat. He's really good. And up here, buckwheat. And also the ones next to it. Heaps of this one. This is how we make seitan. Do we think about eight packets of it? Or ten? Get ten packets. Because one goes per meal, so if we get 10, that's only five days. We're gonna have to come back and get some more. We've got a video how to make seitan. If you wanna check that out, I've linked it below. You just have to do some walks. <laughs> if you need to find them, you just look for a pussy girl like this. Corn flour, potato flour. We make our own pea soup. We don't buy it out of a can ever to be ready because usually they have had meat in them and milk. So grab 10 packets. We go through two packets of peas for one meal. So that's five meals there. You got them? Yep. yep. There. This is us shopping for chickpeas. We got the whole, come here. 
we get the whole box. <laughs> Show us the front else. of the chickpeas so people can see it. Mung beans, grab the whole box. Aphrodite's favorite food. We go through a lot of this kind of stuff. Aphrodite eats the most of these. The brown beans, there's not much left. Grab these ones down here, put them all in the same box. Grab all the brown beans. Also, there's some more here. And then kidney beans. And grab a box of kidney beans too. Wait, 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 wait. There's one probably back there. Move all these in the my brain. We got chickpeas, kidney beans, brown beans, and mung beans. We say that in the morning we always put on beans for about four to eight hours. Yeah. This is why we go through so many. Lentils. Let's take that. Yeah. This. This is what we always buy. We always go through loads of them. We actually ask the shopping center, which day have you filled? Because we have come here and there's sometimes been like three and yeah. for us, that's a bad thing. Yeah. Next thing, red lentils. Grab a whole box of that. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> we go through so much of this. These are the chilies what we get. We go through a lot of chilies. Yes. A lot. These are the chilies we like to use. We make a hot sauce out of this. We use garlic, onions, and a few more ingredients that we will tell you later. Processed food that we do buy is barbecue sauce. Yeah. yeah. But everything from pasta sauce to salsa to chili sauces, we make our own. You notice these are our drinking glasses. No point going and buying separately glasses for the little children when you can just buy jalapenos. Yeah, they can smash. And get a glass. For free. Oh no, not for free. But. The boxes go in the fireplace because we need to have them in the fire anyway when we yeah. start because it's the house is cold in the winter here in Finland. The glass gets used and the little bit of plastic that is left over from these kind of packets here, they actually go into the plastic recycle thing and the little bit of metal that is left from the tops go into the metal recycle. recycling. Yeah. We recycle everything. We don't actually have a rubbish where we throw stuff and what food is left over that goes into compost we don't actually leave any mess that way we don't buy the taco mixes or spices we make them ourselves at home exactly so we just buy big amounts of spices and we make our own so we've got different spices for different things we basically checked what's on the packets of these ones here and we took out the msg and different things that we didn't like there's a processed food that we do buy we buy taco chips jerusalem's favorite Probably from the videos people have seen that you like to put an entire packet of chips with beans and different Taco stuff on mountain. top. Taco Mountain. <laughs> we don't buy pasta sauce. We make our own. We put onions, tomatoes. You will see the amount of onions and tomatoes that we buy soon. We make it ourselves and we store about 10 liters. We put them in the jars that we actually have bought. When we buy olives and onions, we get the glass jars. Those glass jars, we actually use them and the lids to make pasta sauce. So sometimes in our fridge, you can have up to 20 cans of ready-made pasta sauce or salsa. Yeah, we make sushi a lot and this is the sushi no, that we use. We're gonna get four packets. That'll be 40 sheets. Each. Rice vinegar. We know how to make it ourselves at home. We like But we really like the taste yeah. of yeah. this. So yeah. we... Certain things, even though you know how to make them, they are just so yummy that you have to buy somebody else's. And another thing that we had to point out, at the end of the aisles, how they sell special things, we never ever get suckered into buying them we don't they're usually the most expensive things and always pretty much processed yeah. we do taste them but pretty much never buy them and with these i just wanted to note that when we make a meal because there's so many this actually does go fast because we use this packet and this packet and this packet and we mix it together and it goes into one meal so we go through a lot so this is not weeks and weeks. We don't want to walk around with three trolleys at the start, so we always have to go and get a third and a fourth one. Yes. It's time to do that now. Yes. It's always the older children that go shop with me. D'Artagnan, yes, D'Artagnan is normally with us, but we left him with Dad because we are packing to go somewhere. This is the sugary aisle. We do buy sugar. The nut sugar that we get. This is a nice brand to buy. We don't buy heaps of it because everyone will eat it. Also, this is the agave that we buy. We put it in place of honey. It was so easy really nice. to change yeah. from honey to agave. Really 
have you don't really notice it. No, you don't. We don't normally buy tomato sauce, but we're going to have to buy some today. So we chose this Felix one, and if you look at the back, it says right there to subscribe to PewDiePie. Next aisle. Barbecue sauce and soy sauce. We don't we buy pesto. Sauce. We make our own pesto because it's just so lovely with a whole heap of olive oil and fresh basil. Oh, yum. And even if we do buy these, that's such a small amount. It's not enough for us. No, when we go and put about, I don't know, 30 potatoes in yeah. and we have a little jar of that, not it's just not going to be no, enough. Especially when mum eats the whole jar. <gasps> <laughs> Barbecue sauce. I forgot something. Wasabi. We love mayonnaise. Pretty much the only one that does not have egg. There is one other one, but we like this one the most. Yeah. We use this for salad. Okay, use it for the tacos. Nachos, sorry. <laughs> okay, take it. I'm Nachos. doing dancing. Take it. That is... Why? Why would you... No, I don't want to smash it. <laughs> Vinegar. We put gherkins in it and we also use it for cleaning the house. We put yes. water and vinegar. We've been doing that for over 20 years. And it works very well. It Better works than well. You would think. Everyone has clean skin and they're healthy because we haven't been spraying our house with chemicals. Really good to clean toilets, takes the brown parts off. <laughs> Who allowed the brown part to come? <laughs> <laughs> this is the olive oil that we're going to be getting now. We usually go to the city to get one that is cold pressed, but right now we are getting this one. We go through so much olive yes. oil. A lot. So much olive oil. <laughs> Too much olive oil. Yes. We don't make our own beetroot. We used to buy pickled gherkins, but now we make our own. We've been doing that for a few years now, and we go through so many of them. We like to put gherkins. Onions. 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 Garlic Onions. and vinegar. And cucumber. We would normally buy these cans here because if there's an emergency and you can't cook up beans in eight hours and we need them straight away. Sour crap, but we don't buy it. We make it at home ourselves. And we can make a video of us making it. And it's very good for tummies. Black and green olives. These are like lollies at our house. Yes. Hide them. We're in the soft drink aisle. Do we buy soft drinks? No. Never. <laughs> Cordial? No. We drink? Water. Water. Cordial we don't. makes your brain hurt. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, they don't like the colorings in them. Yes. We well, make our own berry juice, but we don't put sugar in them. Yes. We don't really drink oat milk, just put it in cocos. Yeah. Everyone, welcome to my favorite aisle. There's a lot of nuts and... We make our own muesli bars. So this is where we come and get a bunch of nuts. We're going to stop here, we're going to grab them and then show them at the end. And also where... There they are! Guys, yeah. the flaxseed. We buy a lot of this. You need to yeah. be putting this on your food. If you're vegan or plant-based, you must have this. There's usually popcorn here, but it's gone. We can't live without popcorn. We don't buy dried fruit because we have a tree hydrate at home. Salted peanuts, regular peanuts. Mm -hmm. Unsalted, hazelnuts, sunflower seeds, flaxseed, cashews, cashews, almond, brain nuts, <laughs> dates. We put the dates with the chia pudding. We put dates, chia, and oat milk together to it's make really that good. nice. Really I know. It's one of our favorite breakfasts. I've got an appointment to go to, so I'm going to leave Jerusalem, Cleopatra, and Romeo to do the rest of the shopping. There goes mom. Look at mom run. She looks like, a, you know, bubbles from the Powerpuff Girls. Yeah. Just yeah. in white. Okay, so now we are going to be doing the rest of the shopping. Throwing it in the uh, oh, oh, I was, sorry. That's good. So on Fridays, we usually make pizza together. Yeah. And for the cheese, we use this. We get about four of them. And it nicely melts onto the pizza. Very nice cheese. Very nice. Very Next. Nice. Hi. Okay. <laughs> okay. We always get this Himalayan salt. It's the best one out of them. Pink salt. It has oh. lots of minerals in it. Garlic powder. Yeah. And up here we have ginger powder. Curry, we use a lot of it. Paprika. Both of them are like our family favorites, you say? Yes. Yeah. Mommy's back! Mama, we like. The Chanel's new glasses. The Chanel. Ooh! The Chanel's <gasps> new one. They look so I good. They look cool. Do I get them? Yeah. Do you still get to keep the like... skull ones? I'm getting two pairs of the skull ones. What color? Silver in and, silver, and, and I'm getting this. I like this. this is, Are you getting a black one? It's weird. It's like an old TV screen. I think they look really cool. nice. I like them. Do I get them? 
Yes. Okay. The lines are there because they're measuring them. Okay. I will be Do you back. have Can a black pair, of, black pair of the skull? Yes, we still have to go to the aisles that way. I'm getting two pairs of the silver skull for one pair of these. Okay. okay, that's good. That's good. Bye. Bye. <laughs> what is this? Right now, we are entering into the, <laughs> the aisles called why didn't I wear a long sleeve shirt? Why didn't I wear a jacket? Also known as the refrigerated area. Jerusalem is getting the oat milk. Vegan sausages, they're very nice ones. Mom's coming back. I know I got new glasses then, but this is another pair of the same ones. I got two in case someone bends them into a pretzel. Cleopatra got daddy's glasses and bent them into a pretzel. Like, so I've got two oh. pairs just in case. And I've got another Chanel pair coming that I am picking up in about two weeks. Have you got everything? Yeah. Okay, we have got to go to the fruit. My favorite part is... My favorite part of the We go through lots of avocados, so three bags of avocados. And have to buy raspberries and blueberries because we have picked our own from our yard. We have got a whole freezer full of berries, lingleberries, blueberries, blackberries. Also, we don't need to buy apples. Well, in the winter we buy apples, but in the summer, where do we get our apples? From my auntie. Pomegranate, some honey melon and cantaloupe. We buy a little bit of fruit all the time because we come so often to get more. Rocket, four bags of spinach. These are big bags of spinach, but we go through four of them really fast. We'll grab three bags of kale. Broccoli, we need to get at least six broccolis. We go through a lot of that. There is something that the children do fight over. Would you like to explain? Yeah, one's eating the broccoli and then they take it out the other person's mouth and puts it in their own and then the next one takes it out of their mouth and puts it in their own mouth. Broccoli's like gold at our house today. They absolutely love their broccoli. There's what we've got so far. Cauliflowers, I don't know, pumpkin, six celery, 10 zucchinis. We like to use a spiralizer and make vegan spaghetti. Zucchini spaghetti and make a nice white sauce. Eggplant, ginger. We don't actually buy any jam like I said. We make our own, so Paul will be making ginger jam and also be putting this in tea. Jerusalem's over here getting the onions. Everything you do basically needs onions, onions, onions. And we put onions into our raw mixture with cucumber, vinegar. Omega likes to pick out the onions that have been in the vinegar. He does. Three big bags of bananas. We're gonna get some capsicums. Now with capsicums, there are male and female ones. On the left here is a male one. They're more for cooking. One on the right is a female one. They are more fresh for salads. You have them more raw. There's some info for everybody. You may have heard some people say that when they've had a capsicum, they go, oh, that didn't taste quite right. That's because someone may have put a male one into a salad and they're the ones you cook more. So I was just explaining that a second time there. They have their special things that they need to be doing. 20 cucumbers, mainly they go into the vinegar mixture with the onions that Jerusalem's getting over there. These are big bags. We're gonna take four bags of carrots, grapes. Romeo's finished getting 20 cucumbers. They're not going to last long. And now we need to go and get, I think at the least, 60 tomatoes because we make our own salsa and pasta sauce. What is one of our favorite breakfasts? Rye bread with tomatoes and garlic on top with some Himalayan salt and flaxseed ground powder on top. Jerusalem is back. He has got three bags of onions. We go through so many onions. Here are the tomatoes. There's 20 in one bag. I usually buy a few bags, so obviously 60 is not going to be enough. We're going to go with 80. Romeo's getting the garlic. Yeah, we're going to need more than that. Yeah, more than that. Yeah. We go through a lot because we like it on our rye bread with our tomato. And we also like cutting it up and putting it into olive oil. We like to also put it in our salsa and in our pasta sauce. Like I keep saying, we don't like buying processed stuff. If your life is really hard where you have to buy the processed stuff, try to change things. So it's easier for you to make food fresh. Try and change a few things just to make life easier. Because if you start making it yourself, you will save money. And also it's much more healthier for yourself and your children. And even if you don't have children, it's still healthier for yourself. Four lambs and four lambs. All these yummies here. But I'm just going to get the coriander this time. I want to check everything just before we leave. In case there's anything else that that needed. Garlic. garlic. That's a lot of garlic. Yep. We love our garlic. Don't come to our house, we have garlic breath. 
want? Two red chilies, two jalapenos. I need to go and get the oatly yogurt. I was going to show you the label. There's no point in showing it because it's in Finnish. But Yossa, the yogurt is from oat instead of from soy. I don't give my children soy. You guys need to look into the soy situation. It's not okay to give your children processed soy, especially in yogurt form. But when I do buy them, I freeze these in the freezer and I give them on movie nights. So I'll just flip this over. When I go to buy movie food for the children, I usually go for like spaghetti or some yogurt that they freeze up for them instead of some lollies and chips, but the children do get lollies and chips. We've got the last things. We've got the balsamic vinegar and the chia seeds. Did I get oh, the chia seeds. Oh, chia Did seeds. Go and get two more. We look at our food here. This one is all fresh, everything. This one has got flour. We've got a few little chippies on top, but basically it's what well, this is processed and this is processed in here again the whole thing is fresh everything is fresh 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 and over here we have our beans and lentils we have processed cheese here but otherwise it's all healthy yeah I hope you enjoyed our shopping trip we are waiting for Cleopatra to come here we want her to be here for the end Yay! so we have now three chia packages. There's a few things that I wanted to still mention here that I looked at yesterday when I was thinking about the food shopping so I don't get to mention it. But uh, things like, we don't usually try new products out. Like if someone is selling something totally different or processed, we don't go and try it out. We just leave things because otherwise you're gonna just start buying it and that's not gonna be a good thing. One thing that we're gonna get is some frozen vegetables just in case, just like the beans that we have in a can, just in case you're in a big rush, so we're gonna buy two bags of frozen vegetables. They might be there for a few months. Very good, Jerusalem. Go and get it. I already mentioned that I don't buy the berries. I also don't buy the mushrooms because we pick our own mushrooms all over our house. We pick so many mushrooms. We've got picking all over Finland. We've got loads of mushrooms, so I don't need to buy any. Did you have fun? Yes. yes. I hope you all enjoyed our shopping trip. Our children are not fussy. They eat whatever we give them. I hear the parents say that their children are really fussy, but if you just say, this is what you're eating, they will learn to eat that way. Give it a few weeks, they will eat. They're they not will. going to die. Yes. Just give them what you want them to eat. They will learn not to be fussy. You have watched the children's videos where Aphrodite and King James Omega, they shove everything down. It could be the weirdest vegan food or plant-based food or whatever you call it, and they just eat it. guys. We are done, over and out. Oh, it's really hurting now. <laughs> <laughs> All we hear is, I need help, I need help, I need help. Jerusalem went and got our jackets. We put them into the little storage box for a little while. We have finished shopping. Shopping has been done. I am not used to the glasses yet. I got told that I should wear them more often. See without them. Okay, have you pressed the button? Where's my job six good though? Paul and I are gonna go and have dinner. No, lunch. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. We're gonna go have lunch with Aphrodite and Omega at a restaurant. <laughs> we gotta fit it all in there. You're blocking the whole view, you big octopus. Sorry. Okay. Look, the whole place has been taken up by us. Hey, if it broke... No! Did you hear that? If we got stuck in here, we would have food, except we would not have anywhere to poop and pee. Just poo in there. Up there. That's the fucking... No! Okay. You've watched too many movies. Thank you for joining us. We are going to do a, we've got more stuff in a pantry and stuff in a fridge, so we will show you that another time. But thank you for joining us after a long day of shopping. <laughs> after day. Yeah, you're saying goodbye. Aphrodite, 
and Omega yeah. going to the restroom with Daddy. And yeah. Mommy. Yay! I wonder if I can get Omega tonight. Omega Roomba. Yes, Vanessa Marroca. We're gonna go need some pictures. And look her shoes. Yeah. Match her outfit. Okay, I'll come and record your music when I get home. Yep. See ya. It was a fun shop. It's a bit dark here, but we've come to a restaurant. Paul and I is gonna have some fancy stuff. But these guys, they're having this. So it's nice going to restaurants. We pick the healthy stuff for them to have. We would give this stuff at home, except we don't give these at home. Because that's just a big oil bomb, but they like it. Yeah, they're his. And these here are onion ring, not octopus. Yeah, they're yummy. I come to a totally different shop to get nutritional yeast. This stuff, oh, this is yummy. We make all these nice vegan cheese products ourselves with this. Cheese, kale, yummy chippies.